The Daleks continued to improve their technology. They developed factory ships for conquest, TV, the power of the Daleks, and the radio dishes which had originally been required to allow them to travel on surfaces without a static charge. TV, the Dalek invasion of Earth, also vanished, enabling Daleks to move under their own power on any planet. The Seventh Doctor once foiled a Dalek invasion of Earth in Earth's year 2254, which had been planned out by Davros and a Dalek Emperor different from the Golden Emperor on Skaro. Davros had stolen a time ring, for which crime he was tracked down by the Time Lords and frozen in time soon after the Doctor caused the destruction of the Davros-friendly Emperor on Skaro. During these events, large numbers of Dalek variants existed, both on Skaro and as part of the Earth invasion force. Among them were redesigned Daleks with radically different casings, who, for example, had no eye stalk but instead two large round eye holes. Game. Dalek attack. During this war, the Daleks obliterated the human colony of Phobos and experimented with human drones before exterminating them when Davros failed to suppress their emotions. Pros. An incident concerning the continual bombardment of the Phobos colony, in 2400, the Emperor gave an address at the Great Council Chamber ordering a Dalek invasion of the solar system, with Earth as their prime target. This was because, as the humans had created colonies on Mars and Venus, the Emperor was worried that they might try to land on Skaro someday soon and wanted to preempt such an attack. They were able to conquer Mars, Venus, Jupiter and Saturn and captured mineralogist Jeff Stone, comic, invasion of the Daleks, who they set to work concocting paint that would protect their casings from rusting on Venus. Instead, Jeff used lead azide paint to incapacitate the Daleks before escaping with help from his brother Andy and going to find their sister Mary, who was also captured. Pros. Red for danger. They tracked Mary to a Venusian slave camp, where the Daleks were harvesting oil to give them enough fuel to invade Earth. Mary successfully negotiated an agreement which led to an increase in productivity, causing her to be placed in charge of all the oil mines on Venus. Her brothers meanwhile infiltrated the camp she was stationed at, blew up the oil well and armed the slaves to kill the surviving Daleks only to find Mary had been transferred to New Paris. Comic. The oil well. They later located Mary in the Daleks' Venusian headquarters inside the Churchill Mountains. In order to rescue her Jeff caused a power cut in the Dalek base, forcing them to evacuate and allowing the space army to attack suddenly, destroying the entire fleet and liberating Venus. Pros. The secret of the mountain. The war against the Daleks continued, with Jeff going undercover in the Dalek city and discovering key information about Dalek technology. He also saw the Daleks taking control of humans using a Scaro Mesmerista, creating drones which they termed humanoids. One Dalek detected Jeff and raised the alarm, but he escaped with the information. Comic. City of the Daleks. Armed with new information on the Daleks, the Stones proceeded to Mars, where humanoids were sent to destroy their ship's spectroscanner so the Daleks could ambush them. They succeeded in this task but were captured, allowing the Stones to discover the impending Dalek attack and repel them with their ship's weaponry before escaping. Comic. The humanoids, an advance party of Daleks landed in Kent and attempted to lay a liquid metal runway to prepare for an impending invasion. Their attempts were derailed when a mole burrowing nearby damaged the liquid metal sprayer, causing it to spray the Daleks and freeze them in place. Pros. The small defender, Andy and Mary Stone were captured on Gurnian by a marsh Dalek patrol, who attempted to kill them by forcing them into the swamp where the Horicons live. They figured out that the Horicons ate metal and used some to lure them out of the swamp, causing them to attack and eat the Daleks while Andy and Mary escaped in their ship. Comic. Monsters of Gurnian. Eventually the Daleks were completely driven out of the solar system and Skaro was blockaded by the space army, in a military action lead by the Stones and Val Karnin. The Daleks set up a magnetic field around Skaro to keep the humans out, but the space army were able to close off one of the two access openings and prepared to use the other to draw out the planet's atmosphere, forcing the Daleks to surrender. Pros. Breakthrough. With no other options, the Daleks agreed to a peace agreement forbidding them from ever leaving Skaro again and completely disarming them. One group of Daleks refused to this agreement and hid on Earth's moon, where they planned to detonate a cache of nuclear weapons to create millions of tons of debris which they would slam into Earth using a Megla ray. Mary Stone sabotaged the weapons so they detonated an hour early before the Daleks had time to evacuate, destroying them. Comic. Battle for the Moon. 